In this video, I'll be showing you how you can make this really simple but beautiful watercolor print. It's surprisingly easy, so you can do it even if you have little or no art experience. It's a great way to decorate your space on a budget instead of dishing out the cash for an expensive print, and you can be proud that you did it yourself. It also makes a great gift. To do this painting, you'll need some art supplies. These can be found at any art or craft supply stores or even dollar stores if you don't have them already, and they don't need to be high quality or expensive. You'll need watercolor paper, a brush, preferably a tapered one, watercolor paint in the color of your choice, a frame, I got a simple glass frame from the dollar store for about two to three dollars, so it's very budget friendly, two separate cups of water, one for washing your brush and one that will stay clean, a paper towel or something to wipe your brush on, and a plate or palette to mix your paint. Let's get started! The first step is to prepare your paint. I'm using two different blues and black for this one, but you can use any color that you like or that will work with your decor. Watercolors are easy to use, you just have to add water and you're ready to paint. To begin, start by sketching in the stems of your flower. Mix some water with your paint, but not too much water, you want it to be dark, and draw the stems in smooth, long strokes. and meanwhile clean your brush. When the paint is dry, we can go ahead and add the leaves. To do that, first dip your paintbrush into the clear water. Then, apply the water in circles along one stem of your plant. It doesn't have to be perfect. You want the paper to be quite wet where you've made the leaves. Don't be afraid to use a lot of water here. Then just dot the brush at the base of the leaf where it meets the stem. You'll see the color begin to spread from that point across where you applied the water before, making its own pattern. Continue dropping the paint on each leaf, always doing it at the stem. Each leaf will turn out differently because the water will carry the paint however it wants. You can't control this part which I think makes it all the more fun. along the rest of the stems of your branch, being careful not to touch the leaves you already made. When you've finished, set it aside and let it dry completely. paint and touch it up if you want to make it a little bit darker. Once you're happy with it and it's completely dry, all that's left to do is put it in the frame and hang it wherever you want. together which I think looks really nice. And that's it for the tutorial! I hope you enjoyed it! If you did, please make sure to like this video and subscribe if you want to see more in the future. Thanks for watching! Bye!